I think the three most outstanding characteristics of our students tie in very well with our core values, and they are excellent, excellence, respect, and national pride. I don't think it's three, I think it's one important thing. I think that VAS is growing at an exponential rate, and I think the drive to excellence in this school is one of the most important characteristics that you can have. A huge amount of experience. I've been teaching internationally for over 16 years in five different countries, and I worked with many different curriculums, and I can bring them all here. I think my leadership skills are also of great value to VAS. I'm one of the most experienced leaders in the international department. And I think what my team can bring is an integrity and an experience. In mathematics, we have the most experienced team in VAS of all subjects. The mathematics program at VAS is extremely strong. It is one of the strongest I've ever worked in in anywhere in the world. That is because we have an integrated project in which we work with MOAT very closely. Sometimes part of the subject is taught in Vietnamese and then we follow it on in English and vice versa. Sometimes we teach in English first and then we teach it also in Vietnamese. This has enabled both programs to grow rapidly in the last year, producing excellent results. Mathematics in grade five checkpoints is an average score of 5.4, which is way above the world average. That's in the excellent category. In secondary one, which is grade eight, we are also in the top 5% in the world for our scores in mathematics, and we average a score of 5.6 out of six. It gets even better when we go to secondary uh, IGCSE. In secondary at that level, we have over 80% A star to A, which is phenomenal compared to any other school in Ho Chi Minh or almost any other school in Asia. At A level, currently we have only sat grade 11, but AS results are 91% A star to B, which is over 35% above the world average score in AS level. We expect the same to continue on next year. Also, we have introduced two additional subjects in mathematics in VAS. We currently have additional mathematics running for exceptional students in grade 9 and 10. And in grade 11 at HVT campus, we have just introduced further mathematics, which is a second A level in mathematics, and this will be coming next academic year to Batang High. I would say the most important thing is the work that the parents do at home. It's not that they need to do an extra work, but they need to monitor carefully that their children are doing all homework assignments in both Mowat and Cambridge. As I mentioned before, the integrated project is a very, very brilliant idea that VAS is running. And we give homeworks which are appropriate to both Mowat and Cambridge. All the parents need to do is make sure that the children are on top of this and support them where necessary. And if the children are not able to do the homework, that they encourage them to have the confidence to come and ask their teacher how to do the questions. Teachers in this school are more than willing to help the students, but parents also need to be supportive in helping us drive the direction. Okay. Um, we are very lucky in the mathematics department. We are the most experienced department in the school. Everybody in the department is fully certified and the average teaching experience is over six years. I myself have 16 years of experience, but there are one or two people in the department who have 20 plus years of experience, including one member of the department who has been teaching mathematics for 35 years. We are a fantastic, dynamic, creative team who use a lot of active learning in our classes. We believe it's the right way to teach mathematics and we try to make all lessons as interesting and engaging as we can. Not all lessons are appropriate for active learning, but we try to build it into our curriculum as much as we can. And that goes all the way from grade six to grade 12. And we prepare our students as a result to be better for universities, especially in America, Australia, and the United Kingdom. Because if kids just continue on the traditional mode way of learning, it doesn't prepare themselves as well for education in universities abroad. Whereas the active learning that we use in mathematics in Cambridge does prepare them for what they're going to see outside this country.